Well, some peculiar footprints have popped up here on state land, and they've got the people who work at the Brighton Horse Stables wondering if there's a bear lurking around. And now Detroit's Matthew Smith has the story. A wet, sloppy day has workers in Howell. Busy stabling cold horses. People come from miles away to ride these animals. What they don't come for are bears. Well, it scared me at first. Maddie Connolly is one of the guys that works with the animals at the Brighton Horse Stables. <laughs> She's known some of these guys for years, so she doesn't want to see anything happen to them. Um, the hose was hooked up to that um, spigot, and it was a little softer right here. She's showing me the exact spot where workers here first spotted what they thought could be a paw print of a bear. As you can see in the photo, there's frost in the ground over the winter. But the newest print, that came just days ago. In the sand, I'm always watching the ground when I'm riding to make sure there's nothing in the way for the horses. There was something that looked like claws. The print measured about seven inches long. Between the horses, chickens, and other animals that roam this farm, there was enough reason to reach out to the DNR. They tell me that it's rare that a bear would make its way here, but it's not impossible. The same photos you're seeing on your screen here have been turned over to an investigator. But for now, the workers here are just keeping an eye out and staying positive. We've never had a rabbit like eaten by anything or a goat taken or a pony. So whatever it is, I think it's harmless just because there's so many small animals it could prey on and it hasn't. For now, though, they'll wait and see whether they have one more animal to keep an eye on. Reporting in Howell for the Now Detroit, I'm Matthew Smith.